Welcome back to part two. So, um, long story short, we beat he Ryan. He kicked his butt. Her butt, its butt, their butt. Her butt. Lots of butt. Lots of butt. There was a moment I thought I was going to lose, but I pulled through. Not bad. Oh, VIP to the next show. Looking forward to it. Oh, God, that's right. Heh, <laughs> front row stage, baby. Well, good. Shadow Ball. Good. Even better. Aw. Well, I'm glad she's cheering me on. That's nice. So, unlike usual, where I would normally... Oh, there's Weird Guy. <laughs> I was gonna get to a point, but then the Weird Hassle... Hostel showed up. Exciting full marks, gold star, extra credit even. Hardly had you sent <laughs> sent out for Rigoraf before you launched into your strategy. Wow, you actually noticed that. That's actually interesting. That unrelenting offensive, the flurry of attacks. What an efficient way to corner the opponent. What an artfully trained Pokemon. Such a vibrant palette. Moves. Oh, I do beg your pardon. I didn't mean to let out my emotions run amok like that. And he's awaiting the day when I'll meet the Elite Four. Nah, gotcha. Come to the Academy. Sure thing. I wonder has anyone ever not gone back to the academy and just played through the whole thing? I'm sure that's probably been a thing. But then again, I don't want to play the mini game where I have to can somewhat date your teachers. That's just weird. Yeah, that's the thing. So, I was trying to say, unlike how I usually end things, we are going to take a trip. Back to Madali. Over the river and through the woods to Grandmother's house we go. Or at least close to Madali. Oh, no. Cascarafa. My bad. You don't even know where you're going. Ha <laughs> ha. This is why you never give a man a map. <laughs> okay. I, <laughs> I can fly there easily. Or I could run the whole way. Nah. Uh -oh. Nah, let's fly there. It's time to take on Team Star's captain because I kind of put it off a little bit. So I, again, like I said, I would have ended it at part one, but because I had to finish it here in part two, this is kind of continuation slash continuing to the next story. So I don't even know what you would call that. <laughs> Welcome to part two slash new episode. Still TNT. I still turn up Thursdays on. Turn up Thursdays, but just kind of crazy. So, I'm just going to do a quick switch of team, just quick, because he's using dark types. Not too bad. Keep Tinkaton in my uh, arsenal, and we should be golden, allegedly. <laughs> allegedly, a few seconds into the match. I'm dying! Somebody send for help! Why are you just standing there? Help me! Excuse me, Nurse Joy. No, not the technical machines. I press Nurse Joy. There. Come on, gang. Get it right. Yeah, so we're going to do a bit of healing, then we're going to run all the way to beat the piss out of this captain. Well, that's not very nice. Well, it's not very nice of them taking students out of school from their studies because, I mean, not every student's being bullied, but they were. They have a just cause, but at the same time, they're still causing a lot of ruckus. They're like the anti-team rocket. You're, you're, 
you are not causing ruckus? Of course not. I'm oh, defusing no. ruckus. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Uh -huh. God, I hate not knowing if it's shiny or not. I do. I really do. I almost missed the shiny Noi bat. I caught it. <laughs> but boy howdy was my heart pounding because I thought I would lose it. I thought it was going to despawn, but luckily it was uh, running away towards the stone. Video I might upload one day. Under one condition and under one factor. If Nintendo gets their junk together and actually does this one thing. If we have clips and little snippets of videos, and we have YouTube on our Switches, let's upload little clips to our YouTube channels if they're already connected. Why is that not a thing? Oh no, you can upload it to a phone or a cellular device. That's about as dumb as when it's easy you can use a dang Bluetooth device to hear your Switch, but you made it seem like you couldn't do that. Nintendo, you uh... You doing alright? You smoking some weed? Some bad weed? Some probably some bad weed. Wait a minute. Oh, I forget where the entrance is. Gotta get some height. Whip. There we go. Ah. Behind me. Gotcha. Up we go. Hey, how you doing? Doing good? Everybody uh, doing fine? That's good. Alright, there we go. Found it. And cutscene. Eventually. Am I that kid? No, of course I'm not that kid. Maybe I am. What you gonna do about it? I'm not getting through. <laughs> oh, are you getting pissy because you won't? Because I won't buzz off. Well, open the doors and I'll just be on my way. Please don't make this an ugly scene. You try to warn them as best you can. I honestly tried. Now, please stand aside. Oh, I can't believe I lost! Why does such a sassy kid have to be so strong? Because I was trying to warn you. Hasta la vista. Did you just... These guys are corny. And it's cute. It's, a, it's adorably corny. Well, hello there, Cassiopeia. Oh, he's the one who produced the music for the battle theme. Well, he did a pretty good banger job. You really get you pumping.
I'm ready. Let's do it. Oh, so that's what it was. The first time when I was freaking out, like, why are there three Pokemon on my side? First three Pokemon in my party get to battle first. Now I get it. Ready, Tink? Let's take him on. This is kind of depressing. I'm literally beating grasshoppers. It's whack a grasshopper. This is depressing. <laughs> That's depressing. Who wants to play whack a grasshopper? Well, I'll be your guide, and then I'll get my butt whooped. Germany, no! Be patient. Oh, <laughs> Pinocchio! I'm sorry, I'm thinking about the live action one that a certain company that shall not be named under reasons because they might look at my video and be like, hey, how dare you make fun of our movie? Well, Guillermo del Toro did it better. Unless you can top that, you can stay in the corner. Are you talking about what I think you're talking about? Yes. Oh my lord. Pinoke. How great would it be, <laughs> just random thought now, how great would it be if we got a Pinocchio based Pokemon? Not. It would be, it would, it would work. Oh it could work. Lord. It could be Dark Grass or fucking Dark Fairy. It works. I'm telling you it works. Kill them. Squish the grasshoppers. Aw, you're adorable. Look at you. Wait, don't. Aw. Well, the adorable's gone. Squish. Squash. Splat. Womp. Moving on, moving on. Aw, I feel bad about these Zoros. Moving. They ain't even trying to hide, they just, they're just dying now. I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. What's up here? Oh, okay. I was wondering why there's platforms all around the bases. I never actually went up one, so I, you know. Alright. Come on. Break. Mr. I won't lift a finger until you beat 30 Pokemon. <laughs> now aren't we the Mr. Pretty Boy? I do like your uh, your mobile. That's pretty badass. Like I know they got their own colors and stuff, but I think yours is more badass. Look at that. The black amongst the purple neon. Boss of Team Stars Dark Giacomo. And the composer of the, the badass Team Star theme. Which fucking rocks. Look, I know it's a dark team, but my screen doesn't have to be dark the whole time. Thank you. Much better. Yeah, I'm a party crasher. DJ Vice, call me whichever. It's the vibe either way. Nice to meet you and all. But how about we skip the straight into the out outro? I'll play you a sick requiem as you crash and burn. My man's got balls. Too bad I'm not the. That or he's gonna break mine. Come on, you. I'm an adorable little scamp. Nah, I don't think it's a bad move. If anything, I think it's hilarious. Oh, 
<laughs> what I don't think is hilarious is your Starmobiles are literally Pokemon that cannot be obtained and have moves that cannot be learned. Which sucks. Yeah, how about we don't? Get out of here. Next! Well, the hell it was not- oh, wait. That's all you had? It was that and your Rever Room? Oh, that's gonna be interesting. Yeah, that's the move I was talking about, Wicked Torque. No other- no other Rever Room can learn that move. Or knows, like, different types of that Torque. Torque-type base move. All the Star Mobiles know it, that's not fair. Oh. Is the dance party over? <laughs> All I could hear was a DJ record scratch. Yeah, that's it, buddy. Time to face the music. I know, I'm terrible for that pun. But I let's screw it. I'll wear it with pride with corny pride, like a badge of corny honor. <laughs> oh, some more backstory. Those boots are a bit too big. Team rules, huh? Really? They were big on rules? A student's hair must not be at least a 1.8 inches. I'll write up the darn code. Wow, first time I've ever seen Pokemon use the word darn. Trying to be a bit more mature there? Certainly. Chikomo seems like a pretty swell guy. Just wants to make music and not follow any rules as any young astute teenager would do There's Clive. <laughs> a giant pompadour to make a guest appearance today. <laughs> you get a Quaxwell to style you <laughs> Oh my gosh. Sorry to hear that. Me too. It's sad. It's your fault. Oh. Don't know how. 
Did they kick your butt? They no. did, didn't they? No, I won. I knew it. No, I, I beat them. Did you? Yes. I don't see any proof. What? What? You were reading your story. Good scrub. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you were reading your story. Was I? Are you sure? Did you see me? No, because you weren't looking at me. <laughs> He seems like a swell kid. He doesn't look like a kid. He looks like an adult. He's a teen. Is he though? I'm not googling how old Giacomo is. I'm pretty sure he's like 22 at most. Maybe. The and that pretty much. Yeah. Sure is. Rotom is a cutie. Rotom phones? Yeah. Bigger. I want one. I'd actually like to get the Arceus uh, covering for a phone. Oh, yeah? Mm hmm. The Arceus cover. I say Arceus. But it's Arceus. Everybody says it their own way. But it's Arceus! We're having this discussion now? Yes. Oh my goodness. You welcome, said it wrong. <laughs> welcome, back to welcome back to Le Legends Arceus. Arceus. Arceus? Oh, hey, Penny. Randomly seeing you here. Put right on your ball. I just want to play. Please don't. Sniff, 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 lick. Do you have a sandwich? Coridon, stop! Stop! Down! Down, boy! Down! Bad Coridon! Don't talk to him like that! He'll beat your booty! He's acting like a. Dip. <laughs> True. A really awesome one. A reward for little old me. You shouldn't have. Why do you have a girl's haircut? Ponytail. Yes, dear. There was no other styles that would have worked. Victims of bully, they just found it hard to interact with people. Outsiders found each other and banded together. I mean, I get the premise. They all banded together because they felt like they were outcasts. Outcasts feel welcome with other outcasts. I get that. But they're still needing to face their consequences. And they risk being expelled if they don't go back. But, yeah. See you around, Penny. I love that backpack. Well, that's my time. So, thanks for joining me here on not part two, but the continuation. I'll see all the dudes and dudes in the next installment. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, hit that bell. I'll see you all next time.